Good afternoon, everyone. It's May the 3rd, about 3.15 in the afternoon. And we're out here at the bee yard, and this is the swarm that we gathered up on Sunday. So it's been in the box for just over 48 hours, and the queen's been in a queen clip that whole time. So I'm out here today to release the queen and uh, I've been watching the bees come and go from this box and the one down there on the end. There is activity, not a whole lot, but there is activity on both of the boxes. But I'm not seeing any pollen coming in on either one of them. So I'm going to open this up and get the frame that we've got the queen clip rubber band to. And... Uh, Take it off of there and we'll try to get a video of releasing the queen. I'll be back. Okay, a quick look down into the nuke. And it looks like uh, the second frame is covered on both sides with bees. And the first frame has the one side. I can't tell about the third frame until I pull it out of there. But where the two rubber bands are is where the queen is so i'm gonna have to pull a frame or two out of here to get that out so give me a few minutes and i'll be back well there is the queen clip on the frame i end up having to take two frames out together to get it out without opening the clip i'm going to unrub rubber band it here there's a bunch of bees, nurse bees, or worker bees, feeding the queen. I'm going to use both hands, so give me a minute and I'll be right back. Okay, here's the clip with the queen in it. She shows herself every once in a while there. I'm going to pull one of these frames out and uh, release her on it so i'll be back again this is the frame that i put in there on sunday that had some drone brood some worker brood uh, a lot of nectar so i think i'm going to release her on this one i'm not going to be able to do it one-handed so i'm going to put this frame back down in there and let her out just on the top of the frame they're working on the foundation frame there that's in the box and then there's another frame that's got drawn comb on it on this side and they've been working on that they've been putting some nectar into that frame it was empty Sunday so I'll pull it out here in a little bit and give you a look at it this is the frame with the plastic foundation. As you can see, they've drawn a little comb on it and worked a little bit on this side. And they've got a little bit drawn there on that side also. And this is the frame of drawn comb. As you can see, there's nectar in some of those cells. So, all told, we've got about two full frames of brood, I mean of uh, bees. No brood yet, because the queen's been locked up. So I'm gonna get this back in there and then I'll release the queen. Okay, what I've done is put those three frames in the middle of the box. Uh, the foundation frame is here. This is the frame that I give them with food and brood. And this is the frame of comb I give them. So I'm gonna release that queen. Come on girls. Right here on the top of the, this frame. See if she goes down in there. There she goes. She scurried right down in there. She's down here on the frame there she goes. It has the comb on it. 
Hopefully she gets right to work laying eggs. I put a frame, an empty frame on the outside here and I'm gonna put another empty frame, foundationless frame on the other outside. So I'm gonna get this closed back up and I'll see about checking on some of my other hives while I'm here. Well, these girls seem content. They have plenty of room to grow. So I'll check on check on them again this weekend. Hopefully by then they may be bringing some pollen in. Uh, it's been raining, rained all day yesterday, and it's kind of been damp and rainy today on and off. It's uh, overcast completely. So as I said earlier, neither one of the hives the Langstroth were bringing in any uh, pollen so I'm not too concerned about this one well the activity is all but stopped here at the lands hive I did take the cover off and just look down into the top box uh, there was quite a few bees up in there um, I didn't go any further than that um, there's a little bit of activity over here on the swarm box that we got the swarm in. So, as I said, the temperature's only 53 degrees, so they're not too active today at all. So, we're going to go down to the lands hive and take a quick look and see how, what's going on down there, and I'll see you in a bit. Well, we're down here at the Langstroth, I'm sorry, the Lands Hive. And there's a few bees coming and going at both entrances. Um, I'm tempted to open up the queenless side and take a look, but I'm not going to. Uh, it's too cold today. The temperature is supposed to be a lot better this weekend in the 70s and up to 80, I think, on Sunday. So. Um, I'll probably come out one of those days. This is going to be a pretty short video today. Um, I checked my subscriber count earlier today and I had 109 subscribers. So thank you to all of my subscribers. And thank you for all of my, to all my viewers. If you like this video, please give it a like and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and share it with all your friends on your social media. Until we see you next time out here at the bee yard, happy beekeeping and thanks for watching.